Hey gypsies, welcome back. So I'm home, it's a couple hours later, and I'm just now getting to come back out here and do this, the rest of the Dollar Tree haul, or shall I say part three of the Dollar Tree haul. So let me just jump right in. Um, I need a drink though, Diet Coke. Oh, that burn though. Okay, so I don't have too many things here. Um, two bags and one item and let me show you the item really fast it is one of the yard stakes for the little flags and for a dollar you absolutely cannot beat this I saw somebody hauling and I can't remember who it was but the new spring flags that Dollar Tree always carry and I never really was much into getting them before but now I don't know I just kind of like well, when I saw this, I was like, wow, this looks really nice. So I'm like, okay, I'm going to go ahead and get this. And then I will keep my eyes out for all of the little yard flags for all of the seasons and holidays. I don't know if they even put them out for like holidays. I have no idea. If you know, comment down below and let me know. I'm just curious. Okay. So let me show you what I got here. Um, I got this pack of paper plates. I don't know why. Um... I love paper plates for one thing. I like using them. And there was just something about these paper plates that just, I'm like, I love those paper plates. They're dinosaurs, but they're so colorful. And you get 18 in here. And I don't know, who don't want to eat a pizza roll up on one of these paper plates? I'm just like, I do. I do. I mean, I didn't get it for anybody else, but me. I don't know. They can eat on if they want, but I had to have them. Just cool like that. Okay, I got this for Craven. So what do y'all think? <laughs> I think he's gonna be super excited. And by the time you watch this, I think he'll have done all he'll have already been in a video with it. Yes, with it on. So I can't wait to see how it fits. It's it's um let me just show you guys in case y'all want to pick up one. Okay, it's on like a thing so hopefully it won't be too tight or he won't be able to wear it but I'm like this is perfect for Craven so yeah I can't wait to give it to him he'll be excited about that and then I got this for some friend mail it says think happy thoughts and there's a gorgeous little elephant a little gold elephant up there and I'm just sending that to one of my friends and then I found this for the fairy garden. And I think I pretty much have most. I think there's one more th little thing. Wait, I, I blame that. Let me just see if they're all in this. Yeah, here we go. Okay, so I got three items. And I think that's pretty much all um, of the fairy garden items. So, um, I think, I don't know if this is more. No, I was going to say more of the sweet treats. But it's not. This is an owl, a snail, and a turtle. And I'm sorry, it's a little bit darker now, so hopefully you can see all this stuff. But an owl, a little snail with a ladybug on its back, and a little turtle with, oh, I think it's a mouse peeping over maybe? Is that right? <laughs> I think so. And then this gorgeous little birdhouse. Look at that with the red bird on top. Is that cute or what? I love that. And then the whale, there's a little whale, look. And then it's got, you can see that there's blue water in the bucket. Is that cute or what, guys? I had to have that. There, that's the front of it. It says, wishes, 10 cents. Is it 10? Yeah, wishes, 10 cents. How cute. And you can see down in there, see the blue? So adorable. Oh, here's the other Zoops I got. I hauled one in one of my other videos and here's the second one um like i said i'm just uh given ellen had sent me some and this was the first time i saw them so i picked up two just to make sure i have enough for easter baskets and valentine ba baskets or whatever and then anything left over i mean um 
toys for tots like Ellen does, or like sometimes my office does things, you know, gathering stuff up around Christmas or Thanksgiving. So I'll say, I'll hang on to that. And then I looked for these last year and could not find them. So this year I got not one, but two packs. Um, all it is, is little twine ra rabbits, little twine carrots. And I have no idea what I'm going to do with them. None whatsoever. I don't know. But I just know that I wanted some last year and I missed out. So here we go. I mean, oh, um, yeah, I don't know. Maybe just laying them around, which would look messy. I'm not a decorator, guys. I'm not a crafter or a decorator, as you can probably tell. So, <laughs> okay, I got me some clips for the old hair. Um, I love these kind of clips right here. I've got so many of these kind of clips right here, but I, every time I see them, especially if it's from a name brand company, I'll grab them. And this is from Lily Jane. I don't know if that's name brand. I was thinking it was actually something else. Hold on. Let me grab my glasses up here. Um, yeah, let me check. From Utah, made in China, but it's not a Greenbrier product. So I think it is a name brand product, Lily Jane. But I love the, look at the stripes on that. And the pink, these are sparkly. Polka dots, these are black sparkly. And then these are gold sparkly. So this hair that I've been dealing with all day that won't stay behind my ear. And because today is a wet, rainy, nasty day out there. I would just clip it up just in a little clip just to keep it out of my way or something like that. So, yes, grab those. And then I also grab these here. I'm not 100% sure I don't have these already. I'm thinking I might, but it's, they are like a, I don't know, that top is not really a pink. It's more like a lavender, light lavender-ish. And then the bottom is like a purple-ish. So, and then I grabbed one more of these. It's the um, Jurassic World blind bags. And I already have two of these. And these are for my husband for his Valentine bag because he likes little dinosaurs. So what could be better? I have no idea what kind of things are in here. I mean, I don't know. Should I show you in case you want to buy some? I'm going to show you. And then I'll just tape the bag back up. He'll never know I opened it. Let's do it. Let's do it so we can see what's in here. That way I'll know if I want to buy some more. Because they had a bunch of them. All right, let's see. Yeah, okay, I can tape this back up pretty easy. Okay, here we go. Oh, okay, this is kind of cool, actually. Um, looks like this. And it comes with a little piece of paper that shows you all of the ones that you can collect. So this would be a really cool little set to have. I guess that's the Stegosaurus. That's what I'm thinking. But anyway, yeah. So you can kind of fill the bag, you know. And because I could tell this one was different from the other two that I had gotten. So yeah, he'll, he'll like those. Those are going to be cute. Okay, and then I got two of the new candles. I did not get them all. Um, I felt like I might have already got the macaroon one. I can't remember, so I didn't get that one. I was thinking I might have got it, um, but I got the ice cream and the cupcake one. So ice cream and cupcake, I think they smell just alike. Let me see if it says anything, because I didn't have my reading glasses on when I was in here, and I was like, well, I think they smell just alike. They both say soy candle, and on the bottom, from the Fresh Picked Candle Company, what a cute name, but it does not give a scent. So, I smelled like two or three in there, and I'm like, I'm thinking, let me see, let me take both lids off and do a quick smell. Yeah. Yeah. And they smell really sweet, really, really sweet, almost too sweet, but if, I guess they're the same. This one smells a little stronger to me, um, yeah, but they smell like really super sweet icing or something like that. Um, wait, I think I put the wrong one on. Yeah, yeah, vanilla icing, super sweet. Yes, that's it. 
And I don't know what they're supposed to be, but to me, that's what they smell like. And then, uh oh. Oh, oh. Oh, it went off because, okay. Um, I'm going to start my car just because I'm sitting here and I might as well and start it because I can have this light. Okay, so I got this to add to Jack's collection of stuff that I'm sending to her teacher. So this is reward stickers and there's 180 in here and they look like really cute. You know, it's a nice little roll of stickers. So, you know, kids. They love getting stickers for anything, so that'll be a good little thing, you know, for the teacher to have. And then I found something on the wish list. Um, let's see here. Hold on. I'm trying to... Well, I might as well... Just, oh, ooh, what was that? It didn't sound good, but it couldn't have been bad. I found the little planners, or what are they calling them? Planters, yes, I found the little planners that I've been seeing everybody haul. So what I'm going to do is open them up and show you guys what they look like. And I need a knife in here. <laughs> yeah, that wouldn't be a bad, a bad thing to have. I mean, a little pair of scissors. I mean, let's get real. A little pair of scissors would be much better. So, but these are so adorable. So Jack is, you know, she's going to help. She's going to be doing the fairy garden and stuff like that. So I just thought this would be something cute that we can get her some little flowers and plant in these and just have these sitting on the front porch on our little tables. Look how adorable that is. That's going to be so cute with a little flower. It would be so cute with a little succulent in it. I probably will have some succulents I need to replant by then. So this would be a perfect thing for that. I got that one. That was Hudson the hedgehog and this is Tilly the turtle so let's see what Tilly looks like let's see hope everybody's having a good Saturday morning <laughs> well 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 I mean I didn't realize that this was going to be like an all-day process just of opening these Nails. I'm telling you, nails drive me crazy. Somebody had asked me if this was the sticker nails. No, uh, it's the kind you glue on. Actually, they come with glue in them, and, and I got them from Shop Miss A. The glue inside was not very good, so I've been kind of super gluing them as I go. So, anyway. Look at that. For a dollar, guys, you cannot beat that. These are just the cutest quality. I'm telling you. Look at that little face. That is so adorable. Okay. I've been dying to see these bad boys in person. Person. I got the fox. Okay. Oh, this one's already open, so hopefully it's good. Yep. Oh, my gosh. These are adorable. I just can't stress. Look inside. They're enamel inside and out. Underneath. So cute. Just a little fox. I'm telling you, I'm going to have some cute succulents in these. There's no doubt. That's exactly what I'm using these for. And last but not least, we have, oh, that was Flora the fox, by the way. And this is Uma the llama. So let's see Uma. She's a little taller, so her box was a little bigger. Almost missed out on these bad boys. Because that aisle, there was people down it. And I'm like, oh, I don't think I see anything down the, that aisle that I want. And then I heard the lady that works there say, oh, did you see those little planners that everybody's been looking for? I'm like, what? Let me go back over there fast. And so I dawdled around till I could make my way in there and grab me four. All right, there's Uma the llama. How adorbs. You can't beat them. If you have any little flowers or succulents or cactus to do, guys, go grab me a couple of those. You cannot beat that. Okay, and um, I grabbed a jar of pizza sauce. This is for when I make, um, I bought a, a pizza crust, so this is for when I make pizza. And then I got a pack of napkins. I could not help it. Hello, spring. Look at that. I'm just so ready for spring. I know. I know, I still have a ways to go, but I'm ready. And last but not least, I got this. Um, last but not least, 
I got this. It's just a little jot organizer case. And the reason I got this is to keep my rings in because I have them hanging on the back of my door. I don't have really expensive jewelry. Um, I just don't. I like costume jewelry. I like thumb rings. I like, I mean, this is probably the most expensive piece. And that was because that company, um, gosh, here we go. Brain freeze, right? Somebody said they call it Brain Freeze. Um, yeah, that company, I can't think of the name, but they sent me this ring to review, and I reviewed it. So, it's probably my most expensive piece of jewelry, to tell you the truth. This is just a little Walmart. That's just how I roll. <laughs> that way, if I lose it, I'm not out anything, you know? And I love thumb rings, and I have a ton of them. And this, these right here are actually silicone. Yeah. I love these. They look absolutely metal, you know, or real, whatever you want to call them. And I have a blue one and a black one. And this company sent me these as well, just to see if I like them. And I like them. I wear them all the time. So I must like them anyway. Um, but I'm always trying to dig through there and find my rings. So I just thought if I have something like this, I can just grab and I can just keep like certain rings, you know, in each one. Just keep them organized and easy easily accessible so that is my goal there so all right guys that is my dollar tree haul so i hope that you guys enjoyed it and i hope that you if you are not a member of the gypsy squad to hit that subscribe button so you can be part of the gypsy family um, we have a lot of stuff fun around here and we have a clown if i haven't said that already and um we have giveaways and have fun so anyway please subscribe to the channel leave me a comment down below give me a thumbs up and stay tuned for the next video